biggest faults I see out of most golfers is the inability to be able to square the club face at impact. So many folks out there wait until the last second, so when that club gets about six inches to a foot away from impact, to then try to square the club face. And they'll flip their hands, they'll flip them this way, they'll roll over the hands and the wrist and the forearms. They'll do a variety of different things all in the effort of squaring that club face. But their fault is not at the bottom of getting the club face square. Uh, certainly that's very difficult to do. Even folks with slower swing speeds are still swinging the club much too fast for them to time the club face absolutely perfectly just at impact. This needs to begin, the squaring the club face needs to begin much sooner during the golf swing. In fact, it's going to start from the transition of the downswing from here down halfway. You should already have that club face square. Let's take a look at what that looks like. When I start my transition down to this point, that club face is now square. Notice how the toe end of the club is actually leaning downward a little bit. In fact, the leading edge of my seven iron here matches the lean in my upper body. So I'm leaned over at about a 30 degree angle. So is that leading edge of the blade there. If I were to bend over, notice how it changes with the bend of my upper body. Same thing if I was to stand straight up, notice how now the toe is sticking straight up in the air. So from that position, that's a square club face, that toe leaning in slightly. And I squared that club face in the transition from the top down about halfway down into the, uh, the through swing. When we hit golf balls and we're able to get the club in this position right here, the only thing I need to do from this position is rotate my body. I've already squared the club face. I've done all of my homework in advance. I've prepared myself to now rotate my body in the impact. There's the impact position, a dead square club face, and it's going to help me hit very, very solid golf shots that are going to fly true and towards my target. Let me demonstrate real quick. Practice that little drill. Get in front of a mirror. Perfect spot to really practice this. Swing up to the top. Let your arms fall down and you should notice that leading edge of your iron has the same matching tilt as your upper body at address. You can do that, the club face is square relative to your arc, and you're going to hit really straight, solid golf shot.